Today we're going to discuss how to shoot the Desert Eagle 44 Magnum. This is the Desert Eagle 44 Magnum. Notice the slide is locked back. You're going to take your loaded magazine and insert it into the magazine well like such and slap it in. On this particular gun, it's going to feel like the magazine isn't fully seated. It floats just a little bit. That's normal. That's supposed to be that way. Once the magazine is seated, you're going to hit your slide release lever and rack the slide forward. From there, you want to make sure you have a good grip on the gun. With the Desert Eagle especially, it's very, very important that you have a good grip. You want to take your shooting hand, get a nice tight grip with the web of your hand in the tang here, and your support hand is going to wrap around the front four fingers. Your two thumbs are going to go against each other like this. With this particular gun, it's very important that with your shooting hand, you're pushing forward on the gun while your support hand, you're going to be pulling backwards so as to support the gun extra because it kicks very hard and uh, it's very powerful. So if, if you uh, shoot it loosely, the gun's going to wiggle and the gun will jam. So once you have a good grip, you take your stance, line up your sights, and fire your shots. From there, the gun is locked back, which indicates that it's empty. You're going to remove your magazine. From there, you want to be sure the gun is empty, so I, I like to rack the slide a few times, lock it back, do a visual and physical inspection of the chamber, making sure there's no rounds left. That way you're sure not to put away a loaded weapon. And that is how to shoot the Desert Eagle 44 Magnum.